Hey guys, welcome to another Total Annihilation cast. Please don't forget to like and subscribe if you like the video, and on to the show. Hey guys, welcome back. This is uh, another game of Total Annihilation. This one is uh, Tag Metin versus Corex Novaya. Might be Novaya, but I'm going to say Novaya because I'm not sure how he says it. I don't know if Novaya has ever beat Metin yet. Uh, th I've seen him play a few games here. This map's called Fields of Crisis. I believe it's a rendering of a map from Supreme Commander. Novea in yellow and Tag Metin in purple as arm. See, this is a different. Usually, what people do is uh, what Nova's doing here is uh, he they start K bot in the corner here and then they move out. But Metin walked straight to this, straight past here to the middle ish area. Probably more of a defensible position. I kind of like it. Also going K-Bot. K-Bot's pretty much the standard here. If they do go vehicle, they go vehicle second. Nova's usually a pretty aggressive player. So we'll see how that works out for him here. He's got one AK going each direction. Lots of AKs. Looks like Metin's planning on going mostly eco here at the start. He's got four k -bot cons out, just a couple of peewees and a couple of missile towers. Gonna ra radar target the AK as it comes in. Nova says what WTF. Surprised to see missile towers out so far so early. Very good control here from Metin. It's a pretty big uh, group of AKs though. Going into cons as Metin did. Metin doesn't have a lot of units to defend himself with. Still in one lab here. For both players. Yeah, he's spamming these AKs. And this is kind of normal uh, for games that I've seen of Nova. Really good at the early game with the AKs. Would have liked to see him push in. But he's he doesn't see how, me, how much of a bigger force he's got compared to Metin. Metin's just filling in the inside of his base now. Now that he's got a pretty good base outside here, it's a lot harder for them to sneak around and get into his base.
We've got a second KBOT lab drop in for Nova. Yeah, there's a big force of AKs. I think he could pretty easily overwhelm this right here. Push into the top here if he wanted to. We'll see what he does. See, I'm talking from my god view here where I can see everything. See, but that should be a clue to him right there. That that huge group of peewees should tell him that there's there can't be that many peewees up top. We got a vehicle lab drop in here for Metton. See, I think this is the first game I've seen where he's so timid about his attacks. Usually he just kind of goes in hard. Might be because of who he's playing against. Metton's a very good player. In my opinion, people will disagree, but I think Metton's pretty good. If you've got the tag before your name, then you're a pretty good player. I believe it stands for Total Annihilation Gods, but <laughs> I'm not 100% on that. Somebody can correct me in the comments if they feel the need to. So if you're part of the Tag Clan, then you're a god as far as Total Annihilation is concerned, apparently. Yeah, huge groups of uh, AKs coming in. Oh, switch into Storms now. I'm not sure what prompted the switch, but I guess Missile Towers. He saw Missile Towers, so, and uh, Storms do well against Missile Towers. Got a third lab dropping for Metton, a second vehicle lab. Still pretty big force up here. Good radar placement here. See, Nova doesn't have as much uh, radars as Metton. So he's not sure what's going on. He doesn't even know that this is here. Go, he's walking his commander up with an escort of peewees. Creating some space. It's a lot of storms. D-gunning like a madman took out so many peewees there. And he's dropping a fourth lab. It looks like Nova's reclaiming his uh, first K-Bot lab. Not sure what prompted that. Oh, it's because he's going advanced here. There we go. If he gets advanced up before Menton does, that could be big. But right now, Menton's on a lot more build power. Still would like to see this force push in a little bit. Just because he knows his commander's not there, he might be able to get something done. But at least poke off some peewees. But he needs a radar. He really needs a radar on the top side here. Got a light laser tower. I'm not sure what that's going to accomplish. But it's not terrible placement, I guess. Definitely need a couple of dragon's teeth in front of it. EMGs don't really go over dragon's teeth super well. one of the most passive matches I've ever seen on Fields of Crisis. Oh, here we go. Pushing in. Metton's pushing in. Nova walked his commander up to help with the advanced. Got a bunch of stumpies. Really like stumpies as a unit. I think raiders are better. I've just seen, I've seen more success with raiders than with stumpies, but stumpies are solid. And he's playing arm, so you use what you got. That's a lot of storms, though. It's like he's just got this force just chilling. 
Walk his commander down. Gonna degun some flashes. That was pretty big there for him. He took out probably at least nine ish flashes slash stumpies there. He's gonna get some more. Yeah, that was pretty good. Looks like he's continuing to bring his commander down. I've seen him do this before where he uh, he's going to escort his commander kind of like what Metton did. But he's got to know that Metton's commander's down here because Metton's commander's what brought him out. Still got this force just chilling. Just finished advanced. Oh. Oh, and it looks like he degunned him. Well, uh, that's the game. I, I'm i not sure why he did that. Um, I think he had a decent chance of playing the game out and uh, seeing what happened, but maybe he felt a little bit pressured into the corner there, so that was his way out. But this is the ladder match, so it didn't matter. In uh, in the tournaments that uh, Aiden Knot sets up, degunning the enemy commander is a loss. So if this had been a tournament match, then that would have been a loss for Nova. But because it's just a ladder, it's a tie. It's counted as a tie. But a good game. Again, guys, let me know what you think in the comments about uh, what happened this game. If you agree with his decision to end it like he did or if not. Uh, please uh, like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.